After a year in which LeBron James led the Cleveland Cavaliers to an improbable NBA championship after falling down 3-1 against the Golden State Warriors, the city of Cleveland has felt damn good about itself. But last night, some of the air has been let out of the sail of the city, nicknamed the land, as its hometown Indians lost Game 7 of the World Series in dramatic fashion, taking on the Chicago Cubs, who themselves hadn't won a World Series in 108 years. The Indians blew a 3-1 series lead themselves. In Game 7, the Cubs jumped out to a 6-3 lead heading into the 7th, and it felt like the door was closing, but the Indians put up three runs on the board in the 8th, sending the game into overtime. It was then that World Series MVP Ben Zobris stepped up to the plate with the Cubs tied up at the top of the 10th. The switch hitting Zobris and Illinois native himself hit an RBI double, giving the Cubs the lead. They would go on to score another run in the inning, and the Indians would score another run themselves at the bottom of the 10th, but they needed two, and now the franchise who made many have referred to as the most cursed franchise in all of professional sports gets to celebrate its first World Series in 108 years. Congrats to the city of Chicago and the Cubs. I gotta ask, was that the best baseball game you've ever witnessed? Let us know by dropping a comment below or tweeting us with the hashtag BET Breaks. And for all things relevant in sports, music, and the culture, you gotta keep it locked to BET.com. I'm Rodney Rakai with BET Breaks.